Today we're gonna make some very flavorful baked chicken. It's an extremely easy recipe. Let's get started over here. We have our pan over here, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna spray it with some extra virgin olive oil. We've taken our chicken. Now we're just using chicken quarters. If you want, you can use a full chicken, cut it into pieces, or chicken thighs. We just like this with the extra meat. It's a really uh, non-expensive meal. But we're going to pat those dry, and we want we've let these set out for roughly 20 minutes. We're then going to take those and we're going to spray them again with our non-stick cooking spray. If you don't have this non-stick cooking spray, uh, you can make sure that you use uh, some olive oil. We've created a spice mixture. Now this spice mixture is going to be one half a teaspoon of black pepper, one half a teaspoon of salt, one half a teaspoon of onion powder, half a teaspoon of garlic powder, half a teaspoon of thyme, half a teaspoon of oregano, and half a teaspoon of smoked paprika. I'm just going to take this and stick it on our chicken. We're preheating our oven to 400 degrees. That's going to give it a nice crispiness for the skin. Now this spice rub is, is good enough for about three pounds of chicken. All right, once we get this covered, we're going to place this in the oven for approximately 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, we're going to drop the temperature of our oven down to 350 degrees and then we're going to cook it for another 10 to 20 minutes, making sure that the internal temperature of our chicken is 165 degrees. Mm. Alright, our chicken is now uh, completely cooked. We're going to let this sit on the counter for roughly 10 minutes and then we're going to dig in. These juices here, you can either save them, make a gravy with them, but just don't throw them out. There's lots of flavor of that and you can use it some other time. We hope you enjoy this recipe.